Ah. That's where we're going with this. Down you go. Oh. She didn't like that. Ugh. I am not going to die here tonight. I'm just not. I need to see what's in this hollow. I need to get into that house. Okay, let's go. Things are getting weird. Quite weird. So I'm not dead? It's just I messed with the wind and now this is here? So let's just push it. Until I get to that one shiny spot. There you go. You live there now. And you come over here. And now I have a snowman. I need something special for this. Oh god. I have to get back into that house. This is the worst longest night ever. Well, here we go. We're dealing with the witch now. I did not know where this was going to be going. Or even what I was getting into when I clicked on it in the first place. This has been an experience. Here she comes. Stay off my porch! Ah. Uh, I'm so cold. So cold. No. I'm an astronomer. Those are my skies, damn it. I'm gonna survive this. So I need to avoid its line of sight, I suppose, by throwing it from a distance. I need to get more snow first. There's not a lot of places for that, is there? Is that a snow spot, actually? Yep. Convenient. So can I get away with it if I hide below the porch? Can't throw that high. I need somewhere to hide. Isn't this a hiding spot? Squirrels. North wind. Black wind. Wolf in the dark. Ah, oh, this weather never behaves. Gotta say the whole damn thing every time. Blue fire in the north. I have discovered your secret name. I have buried it deep in the earth upon built this house. Oh, that's interesting. I can get you out of here. You can't even get yourself out of here. I can barely get out of the attic. And away from that extremely creepy shrine. It's not safe for you here. Did you know I made that poison and she never even thanked me? She'll take all the credit for it. What? I know, right? Murdering a god isn't something you want to let someone else take credit for. Oh my god. I thought you were... I'm going to survive. Ah, god damn it. I'm trying to have a conversation here. She seems distracted by that weather thing. Maybe, huh. That's a bummer that they can interrupt you mid-conversation. So, apparently that the person in the attic is the one that created the poison. To the brambles. Squirrels. There we go. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Apparently she's unfazed by that, though. So what's in the attic? Let's just get up there and grab it before they send me back. There we go. Get away if you can. That's it. Alright, well, I don't know if I missed a conversation from last time or not, but that's all we're getting, right? Let's get going. You must obey this house, now blow west. Get out of the way. Okay, that's done. It's as best as we're doing on time. Progress made. Yay! Happy, happy, bouncy, bouncy. Let's get back in there now. Make our make our fourth, fifth uh, snowman that's alive. <laughs> Although, what was last? What were some of the other ones? Honestly. 
Just make the eye face the wrong way, because I can. There we go. That's the snowman now. Hoi! <laughs> What? No. No. <clears throat> no. What is this? Oh. Oh god, no. Girl, what have you done? You. You watched it happen. You watched. It wasn't me. It was this place. It was the oven. It was what you became. I didn't get to choose what happened to me. It was so cold. I was so afraid. I had to survive. And I did not. What is this? Who are you? Don't you dare speak, you waste of a girl. I was her twin. We fled into the woods. Oh, crap. I accidentally pressed it. Except one. When she pulled my body from the water, the only part of me she kept was the tattoo. Ew, is that a slab of skin with a tattoo on it? I've kept it close to me all these- all down the centuries. I believed in some idea of you that is as long dead as I am now, but you survived. I- I- Oh my god. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for this. Get out. I'm sorry, I never meant to. Get out! I mean, they kept threatening us with death, so I mean, screw them. Yes, May? What is this story about? What do you want to be about? If I get to choose what it's about, it's not about anything. Huh, that's quite a statement. I'm really smart. Well, you came with, with that plan to rob banks, so clearly you're onto something. I want to know what this is about. I think you have to figure that out on your own. I don't like that. This is getting really strange and interesting. And the idea that this is all a story being told to May, which that's and then that, that's their. Uh, that's- that's- that's May's grandfather, who is dead in the main game, so that even adds a new layer of its own right. Are you gone already, Sticky? I'm sorry, Sticky. Poor Sticky. He was made to suffer. You're a fraud. Why, hello. Nice of, nice of you to stop by. There are frozen dead people all over these woods. I've talked to half a dozen of them tonight alone. Either no one takes you up on this coffin business, or you never follow through. So which is it? Huh? You talked to ghosts? Yeah, a whole bunch. I think you got lost and cold and started talking to the snow. No. I've been all the way from the Forest God's Mountain to the Hunter's Hollow, for God's sake. And yet here you are, back at my cabin, not more than an hour after you last left. Letting the heat out and the cold in. Busy night for you, eh? Oh, go to hell. <laughs> Hell's warm, at least. Good night. Not a friendly person, but also the only ver the only verifiable, probably real person we're encountering. Should I go back in there and tell them about the poison? We at least know what's going on here, and that now the force came the force god's being poisoned by outside forces, and must be put to a stop, lest they fall from grace and whatnot. Hi there. Godtender Brown. Empress, it's so late. Why are you still here? Listen, this is very important. I know why your god is dying. Wh what? You see, I saw... No, you must tell it to them. 
What? Why? I'm not worthy of hearing of their weakness. I don't deserve the peace I have found here. And I must honor them as best as my frail self will allow. That's really something. Come with me, now. Oh. Okay. Forest God. Nope. <laughs> also disrespectful. How big is it? Oh no. Jeez. Uh, hello? Are you there? You've come late. You are no empress. Centuries have passed since I spoke to one so small and unimportant. It is my right to kill you. I didn't know that. Accept it. Death is happening always. Why should I accept it? It is the natural way. Funny how you decided that the way... Uh, funny how you decided that the way that allows you to kill me is the natural one. Brr. You're not a god. You're just a big animal. They call me a god. So I'm god enough. Tell me, what was so important to say to me that you would give up your own life? I know why you are dying. Brr. I am not dying. Oh, I thought you may have accepted that. Death being always and all that. I was God Tender Brown. It was God Tender Brown who told you. Useless. Worthless. I will find use for him. He will feed the forest. The trees will find worth in him. No. God Tender Brown is a good man. He is kind and curious and warm. Even while standing out in the cold for you. Brr. He thinks he, he doesn't deserve you. But you don't deserve him. And I'd rather you die, never knowing what happened to you, than to have you touch one hair on his head, or betray his devotion. Why are we dying? Promise Brown will be safe. Promise on whatever is holy to you. I promise on myself. I promise on the taiga. Endless. Good. Now swear on what is holy to you. I swear on the search. If that is what gives you hope, fine. Now speak. The only reason I came here is because of God Tender Brown's sadness and his love for you. But you won't survive, and now I want you to know that. Speak. The hunter poisoned you. Obviously. Brr. There was peace after... Hundreds of years, I know. But why? She's a survivor. It appears you won't be. Then neither shall she. Ugh. You big dumb animal. Bruh. Oh. That was way scarier than it was in Ori. In the Bland Forest. That was a very different forest. Goodbye. Well, uh, I'm not sure how our friend's going to respond to their god abdicating their throne. This might be odd. They're gone. They'll be back. They always are. God tender. Yes, Empress. You're a good man. Thank you. I can only hope to be good. Hope is good. Whatever happens, please don't lose that. I wish you blessings on your journey. You as well, happy longest night. Happy longest night to you. I'm getting sleepy, Granddad. We're almost done, May. Okay, good. I like the story a lot. I knew you would. 
You can rob banks with me anytime. So, a false god that claims fame because it can. Attracting the following of people that deserve better. Oh, they're not letting me in again. Oh. I mean, why let me in again after what happened? Me talking about talking to ghosts and burning limbs. Hey. Hey you, still alive, eh? I just saw all the great- all the trees give a great shudder, like they were falling into line, and then you walked up. I think the way is open to the frozen lake. What do you think about that? I think you should wrap up any business you have, and head east as quickly as possible. Huh, what business would I still have? I wouldn't pretend to know. What business would I have? Should I say goodbye to you? I'm a bit nervous about the frozen lake. Do you know the story? Not really. Of how the lake was so deep, it went down to the grave, and the dead came to the surface, and spoke with the living. Of how it was so black, that it ate the moon's reflection, and how the moon, being jealous, convinced the sun to turn its back on the lake, so it would be forever frozen, that is why the dead may be found beneath the ice. For they can no longer leave those waters. Did any of that happen? You're the one going there. You tell me. Hey there, you okay? I didn't have a chance to ask about you. And how you got here. I think I'm gone. I can hardly hear you. Oh. Yes. Thank you so much. You saved my life, fortune teller. I was a real one, you know. I was- it was real to me. Even if... My sister, in the walls... Hello? Goodbye. Oh. She faded away now, and she's gone for good. I would have felt bad if I'd left without talking to her again, I suppose. Not much left, though. Sticky's gone. Yeah, both the, both the snowmen are gone. That's about it, then. Yep. We made them lose their minds for a bit there. Whoops. Sorry. I kind of feel like- I can't help but feel like there's maybe, like, one last thing I can do with the people in here before I leave. You know, just in case. Honk! That's all we're getting out of that one. Yep. Is there one last conversation to be had? Or is he gone? Huh. Oh no. Poor Stevenson. Looks like this thing took a uh, beating from somewhere, something huge, so... I wonder if there's a head in there. Not checking. Why wouldn't she check? I would. So would I. If I ever found a body part on the ground, I'm gonna poke it with a stick. Can't argue with it, you there. Oh, that's- yeah, that's the- the armored helm, is what that is. Poor Stevenson. What a sight. What happened? Did the god kill it? That's an unfortunate revelation. For Stevenson, particularly. Just so we're clear. How do I ed head east? I keep going there, but nothing happens. Do I just need to hold east longer? Yep, not letting us in. All of our friends are gone. Not Stevenson, he was the funny one, allegedly, according to other people that are not me, because I couldn't understand him. 
Man, man. And so I grow slightly concerned that I may be, may be looping again. Am I missing? Oh, okay. There we go. Kid? She's gone. She just left. Just now? All I know is that some time after she left, something happened. She stopped being what she was. I don't know if she died or... But something is happening, happening to me. Can't you just go back home? Child, I am home. Oh. But I am going to visit where I came from. That's good. No. No, you don't understand. I used to hope no one who knew I was gone would come looking for me. But now I'm going to go looking for them. The townsfolk will weep when they see what I've done to them. And as they go into the ground, I will dig them up. I will place them in the beds of those who love them. And people will look at that ruin of a town and say it is haunted. Oh, kid, listen to me. Oh, please, child. Until an hour ago, I was younger than you, but now I am far, far older. You were kind to me, and I will give you this kindness in return. We won't meet again. Okay. So did the witch die, and then it's, it's, it's witchiness transferred to another person, basically? Ah, uh, this builds poorly for me, because they said I was going to die at the end. Hey, cat, figured I'd see you here. You figured right. You figured wrong. How's that? I didn't die in there. So you didn't. But then again, I never died in there either. So pardon me if I'm not overly impressed you did it once. You are such an ass. You certainly caused a lot of trouble tonight. I didn't mean to, just passing through. Isn't that always the way? So what are you, really? Pardon? Some kind of magical cat? Cat god? Cat wizard? Something? I'm just a cat. I live near the woods. I like shiny things. And I listen. Oh. Your turn. Who are you? I'm a survivor. Where I come from, where I was tonight, I've survived. Survival is good. Steal everything. Never get caught. Eat rats. Find the warmest barn. Not how I'd put it, but yes. How would you put it? Just get through the damn forest. Fair enough. I like the stars. They're out there, hanging in black. Mawkish. Yeah. The darker it gets. I need to get going. The hunter... Her child, the forest god, those aren't your business. I know. Leave all of that here. You were in their forest. I'm an astronomer. It may be their forest, but it's under my sky. Ha! Huh. I bet that sounded great in your head. It sounded great when I said it, ass cat. Goodbye, Adina the astronomer. Good luck. Goodbye, cat. Happy longest night. And so that ends. I bet you this- er and everything that we saw today was an illusion and none of it actually happened. Oh, don't fall through the ice. Oh no. That's where this is going, isn't it? Okay, that's creepy. You know, I doubted you would make it. A promise is a promise. How is home? Same as ever. Colder now, of course. The sheep shut down the 5th Street Bridge again on Longest Night Eve. <laughs> the farmers were there all day trying to pull them off. Have they figured out why they keep doing that? No one has a clue. Huh. I know you can't stay along. I can't, so ask. 
Okay, did you find the ghost star? I did. My first night dead. It's there. Oh my god. Something like that. Will you remember where that is? Yes. It's funny. What is? It's always been there. I just had no way of seeing it. You still can't, not really. But you can chart where it is. That's something at least. Wow. I feel like just a few feet away. There's this thing, bigger than I can think about. Burning away, exploding. And between us is this sheet of black. And when I think about it, I feel like I'm going to overflow. I think about this a lot of these days. We devote ourselves to something we barely understand. Something we can never touch. We give it a name. We give ourselves a name for doing so. All of it creates this connection. And that connection, that becomes the thing we can touch. You appreciate those connections even more after you've died. I'm gonna miss you all again, all over again now. Well, on the bright side, you got a star out of it. That's something at least. <laughs> Pretty amazing to be something, at least. Yeah. Goodbye, astronomer. Goodbye, astronomer. The end. What constellation was it? No one knows. It's lost to history. Did this really happen? Does it matter if it really happened? I think it does. Well, we'll never know. But hearing it happen to you... And that's something. Something, something, something. I want to find that constellation. Go outside some night and find it. And tell me where it is, okay? <sighs> you look tuckered out, kid. I am. I'll leave you to it. Sweet dreams, kiddo. <laughs> well, that was the supplemental material for Night in the Woods. I figured I'd slip it in here during the dream sequence, or the lack thereof. I uh, was rather surprised by its sheer length, actually. Like, the first one was about how long as I, th I thought it would be. The second one, significantly longer than I thought it would be. So that was a bit of a surprise. Sorry if anyone's like, oh, get back to the game! But uh, now I will. See? See?